Hey there, Virgos, and happy birthday to you. Welcome back for another general reading. This is a general, so it's not going to resonate for everybody. So only take the part that fits and disregard the rest. So you could be traveling for your birthday. Somebody could be traveling to you. It could represent you're seeking answers because you also have the answer card, the next card, and you got animals. So pay attention to your surroundings. Pay attention to your dreams. Spirit could be talking, sending you messages through the nature, through animals. I'm, I'm almost feeling that you're on this journey here. You may feel isolated because you know you be in the dark in that hermit card. Doesn't, doesn't this seem like a, a isolated energy? But she is in a boat. Or this energy is in the boat. Somebody is traveling, but they may not know which direction they're going. So this could be representing the journey that you're on. Someone could be looking for you because we know that you would go somebody and you'd be in hermit mode in a minute. You may be going within to, to find answers here because your next card is answers. I feel like spirit is going to show you what you need to just stay because your overall energy is the sun card. You could also be dealing with a Leo too. So let's see what is your message today, Virgos. It says, what you wish for will not come about by sheltering within the comfort of your four walls and all that makes you feel secure. See, see some of y'all, y'all going, y'all had now and, and, and you're not doing something. You're being called to journey the road less traveled for the answers you seek. See, I told you, because that's the next card, answer, see. For the answers you seek certainly won't be found while you're sitting on the sofa. Instead, book that trip of a lifetime. Soak up the fiery sun. See, and there go the sun car. See? A faraway land. See, I feel like you're traveling. Go climb a mountain, bath in tropical waters, or make that overdue visit you've been promising. This is the perfect time to go and seek adventure and to retreat from a mundane life. So be the bold explorer. Go and discover yourself what's waiting out there just for you. Now your magical meanings, Virgo, it says a journey reveals answers. See, because they go to answers card again. You need a break. You're protected. See, that's what I told you. Travel brings about the changes you seek. Break from your comfort zone. Freedom awaits. All right, Virgo? Overall, it's the sun, followed by the six of pentacles. You may be looking for money. You may be looking for a generosity. You may be looking for um, money. See? It's time for you to get with it. Look, there it is. Three of cups, the eight of wands. I feel like somebody's about to travel on a vacation because you need it. Because somebody is all out of whack here. Could be with a temperance. Feel like you're holding back. But I feel like something's going to happen where you're going to open up. Now, you could be talking about a relationship here. Something is about to happen here for you, Virgo. But I feel like it represents traveling. What's going on for Virgos? You may be waiting. You may be holding back. Because you're not sure. That go to four ones. Could be about a house. I feel like you're playing it safe by waiting. But that's your energy. Six of Pentacles, seven of Pentacles, four of Pentacles. Strength. I feel like you need to be a critical. I feel like somebody overthinking or self sabotaging it. Somebody's worried. Somebody's stressed. But once again, that goes spirit reminding you of what powers you do have. back door open. I didn't feel like fighting with bees today, y'all. You could be dealing with the Leo. You got the sun and the strength. I feel like spirit is telling you take the take the road, let's travel. Embody that Leo energy with the strength and the sun. You know, Leo, they ain't scared of nothing. They're very, very bold and they go after it. They're very, very confident. They're full of courage. Because I feel like spirit is telling you you're protected. You may not feel like you do, but that's why you need to do something. 
take a leap of faith because you also have the fool card too, but that's in the reverse. Y'all like, uh-uh, because you're not trusting something. But I feel like the only way you're going to get answers to whatever this is, because this is what's showing up, is you're going to have to take the road, let's travel. You're going to have to get off the couch, stop playing it safe, come out of karmic zone, and hit the road or take action. That's what I see. So let's see. For Virgos. Why is temperance in the reverse for Virgos, Sagittarius? Temperance, somebody's lost patience or someone here is not balanced. It's because you may be too busy focusing on the what you can't do or what you cannot get accomplished when Spirit is telling you, well, you look, you ain't going to know unless you move on. There's the chariot. They go travel, see? There's that travel card again, Virgos. Could be dealing with a cancer. Why is the uh, temperance here? Eight of swords, see? There you stuck in your head again. Overthinking things. It's called, see? Eight and the nine. Why is temperance here for Virgos? Just seeing the fool card, because Spirit's telling you, you're going to have to challenge yourself, see? There go the nine of pentacles. You're showing up as somebody here. You need to work on your confidence. Because you're showing off of somebody here who is independent. Maybe this is what you're worried about. Your independence here. You're dealing with your fears. There go the moon. Something could be about to happen in this new full moon. Or spirit is telling you to get out your head. And make it happen. Why is the four pentacles in the reverse for Virgos? Why is this here? I feel like somebody here feels feels like they're not financially stable. Or this could be a problem. But it could be, look, it could also represent, see, four of pentacles in reverse, eight of pentacles. You may be feeling like you don't have it. You don't, you're not financially prepared. But but like Spirit is saying, with this sun, six of pentacles and a three of cups, you may have somebody already in position. You feel me? In position, when, when you take this travel, when you take this journey, whatever it represents, I feel like you already got the answers. You already got the thing, but you just got to take this leap of faith and take the actions and pursue it because I feel like it's already waiting on you. But you only get it if you pursue it, if you go after it. I feel like you're going to get some type of invite out that's going to change your circumstance. It could be a job opportunity here. Two of Wands, but there's some... Indeci indecisions here. But once again, Spirit is telling you, you, you need to take the road, let's travel. There's the Ace of Wands. Be, be optimistic like a child. Because I feel like you got support here. I just feel like you don't see it because there go a King of Cups. Why is the Three of Cups here for Virgos? It could be a romantic relationship that's going to steer you in the right direction. Or maybe you want a relationship. Why is the Three of Cups here for Virgos? Could be a date. Could be a romantic relationship. Or it just could be, be you out partying and having a good time and an opportunity presents itself. Why is the Three of Cups here? Somebody maybe did not want to be single. Maybe somebody wanted to be in a relationship. There go the Knight of Swords. Though somebody coming in with the flag raised. Somebody, somebody coming at in. It could also represent you need to move on or, or make some type of move. Take action. Be honest. Maybe you're about to get the answers you're seeking here, but maybe it's when you're out with the Three of Cups. Maybe you're wondering about a specific person. Three of Wands. Waiting. You could have turned your back on somebody. See, and there go the Knight of Wands. I feel like you're curious about a person. Could be a job, but I feel like it's romantic. Why is the Six of Pentacles here? See, they go to Virgo car. See, somebody, somebody's been trying to get in contact with you, Virgo, but y'all hiding. And I feel like whatever's been, it's like somebody trying to get you out the house and you like in because you're dealing with your own issues, but Spirit is saying, nope, this ain't the time for you to hide out and stay on the couch. It's time for you to get out because what you've been seeking is out here. Six of Pentacles, Virgos. 
Somebody trying to get you to come outside, Virgos. Six of Pentacles, the world. There's travel. There it is again. But you don't trust this. Seven of Swords. But there's the Knight of Pentacles. Could be about a romantic partner here. Somebody's trying to show you something. They're trying to get you out the house, Virgos. You got a, you got a trip here. Seven of Wands, but I feel like you're guarded. And you're not and you're not backing down. But I feel like you you <laughs> Feel like you need to take a different approach. And there go the nine of wands. See if y'all ain't standing y'all ground and blocking folk. But look, there go the king of pentacles. And there go the page of swords. Somebody checking you out. Could be a job. I feel like you got multiple opportunities here. It could be romantic. Somebody's looking for you. See, and there go the magician card. See? I feel like you're behind the scenes manifesting, but you're not going to know if it's coming to fruition because you're playing it safe. That's what I'm getting. But like I say, you're not in the dark because the universe is, is bringing you joy, happiness, illumination, clarity. Why is the sun here for Virgos? Because for some of y'all, you're worried. You, you're not sure about something. But I feel like it's going to serve you well. Why is the sun here for Virgos? Four of Wands. They go to Five of Wands. Got the Four of Wands twice. Could be a twin flame. Some type of house. Some type of... Uh, Party, outdoors, events, because you got the Three of Cups. Could be a Leo. But there go the Ten of Swords. So you may have lost a commitment with somebody, and now they're going to reach out to you and try to get you out the house, and you're not going to trust it, but you want the answers. You may want to know what this person has been doing. And I feel like they're going to tell you, see, they come in Knight of Cups. Knight of Pentacles. They've been coming. They go to Six of Wands. Somebody's receiving karma. Why is the Eight of Wands here for Virgos? Travel. See, Two of Pentacles. I feel like somebody got their one foot in and one foot out. Somebody's afraid, but I feel like it's going to bring a lot of emotional fulfillment. Could be someone from your past, somebody that you've already walked away from because you may have thought that they were dating other people. And I feel like you want the answers, but you're not going to get it hiding out. I feel like if you hang out or you take an invite out, you may go out and you may see what you need to see. Because look at, look at this opportunity, Ace of Pentacles, see? And there is justice, see? Could be a Libra. Could be a new job opportunity coming your way. Whether it's love or, or whatever it is, a jo job or love, you still got to come out the house, Virgos. The strength, why is strength here for Virgos? See? <laughs> strength. Three of cups. There it is again. The Five of Cups. Somebody's dealing with a lot of regret. Somebody still needs to heal. Because they'll go to Star Card. So there's a lot of delays with the Hangman. Because somebody ain't, ain't giving in. Seven of Pentacles for Virgos. Could have been with a Water Sign. A Fire Sign. Seven of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. What's going on for Virgos? 
got offers coming in, but for some of y'all, y'all got them blocked and y'all are hermit mode. Spirit said, you're going to have to come out the house and come off the porch to go to Star. Oh, this was the sun card. My bad. That's the star. You got the star and the sun. See? I feel like you was in love with somebody. But I feel like it came to an end. They go to Queen of Cups and they go death. Because you also got the King of Cups. So you may only be focusing on your money right now, your career. And you got other opportunities. But I feel like somebody's trying to heal. So they're hiding out. And somebody's trying to get you out the house. Four ones could be your friends, could be your, your person. It's like where Virgo at? See, four ones, ace of swords. I feel like the answers you've been seeking, see? See, you hide now. I feel like you're just staying in and you're just replaying things over and over in your head. Uh, the negative things. But you got something good here too. Why is the four ones here? You got opportunities here, but I, I see a breakthrough happening. Eight of swords in the reverse, because I feel like you're going to come out of that. Two of swords in the reverse. Seeing things for what they really are, getting the answer, the five of one. You may be finding out that you got some jealous friends around you, too. It may be jealousy on the job and you're trying to relocate and find a better job. You could have gotten into it with your, your person, your romantic partner, and now you're seeking answers to find out what, what have they been doing in the dark. But once again, whatever, whatever challenge you've been facing, Spirit say you can't hide. You got to come out because whatever problems you have, you got the answers once you take actions, Virgo. That's your reading. Please like, share, and subscribe.